Hi everybody, this is Stephanie from Razzle Dazzle Rabbitry and Yarns LLC and we are taking a walk. We're going to show you in this video how we harvest and dry grass by hand for the winter time. So this is a pile of grass that we've harvested earlier today. It's, as you can see, a handful of grass. It's hung up just by a bungee cord and when you do this, you're going to need a pair of scissors or something to cut the grass with. You're going to need grass that's chemical free and you're going to need something to hang the grass up with. You are also going to need to have it in a spot that has sunshine and access to air. So this is a spot, it's actually our little light post on our at the house and you can literally just hang. It has these little holes right here and we just put the bungee cord in there and we just hang some grass. Now this is not going to work if you have a lot of rabbits. If you are trying to harvest hay for quite a bit of rabbits, then this is not something that is going to be a effect, an effective method for you because this is something we have uh, two rabbits right now, a buck and a doe, a breeding buck and doe, and they're five babies. So we don't have and we do not ever keep a lot of rabbits on hand. Our rabbit tree only has six holes, two of which are two by two foot pens, which we're walking into, and they are the temporary pens. These are for grow outs, so bunnies who are waiting to go to their new homes, these two are. And so we have our, hello Mariah Carey, we have our, and babies, they're just chilling right now, it's warm out, but we have our four foot pens with our bunnies in it, and of course we have Arthur who has a little bit hanging from his beard. And so um, we don't we don't need a ton of um, we don't need a ton of hay. We will still buy bales of hay. So we have our scissors with us, and we're gonna have to grab a bungee cord, which I'm gonna grab one from um, grab one from the barn. We'll be right back. So we have our bungee cord now. And this is not a very long bungee cord because again we just use a handful and this will this will hold about a handful of hay. So we have a lot of different grasses that are allowed to grow around the rabbitry. So we have a ton of grass that's underneath the lilac bush and all the way on the edge. We have also just all sorts of mixed greens that we can use for um, for harvesting grass for the bunnies. So this is an area which we've been harvesting in the uh, spring. It does get pretty low because it's slightly inside of a ditch. And I'm gonna set the camera down and so you can see and watch us harvest. So it's underneath pine trees and you get things like pine branches. So this one's a bit in the way, a little large. And I'm gonna set the bungee cord down. So we just hold and snip the grass. So we keep all the cut ends to one side. We don't mix up the ends that haven't been cut with the ends that have not been cut. You don't have to use scissors to clip. There's all sorts of devices you can use to clip. And again, we just want we just want a handful of grass. We don't need a lot because if we put too much grass together in a bundle, a little bit more. If we put too much grass together in a bundle, it's not going to dry. And then you're going to end up with the potential for moldy grass and mold and rabbits. They're two things. You don't want that together. So. We have our we have our grass. It's about a handful, and right about you take about a hand length and you squeeze it together because we need to take this bungee cord. There's a lot of mosquitoes, and we need it to go around the grass, and we want it tightly around the grass. So just like that will do. 
Let's grab our stuff and go hang this up. So here's the grass. It's just kind of suspended by the bungee cord. And wherever you can find a good place that has sunshine, that has access to air and wind, that's gonna be a good place to hold and to hang this. Now, the, the weather matters when you're actually putting this out and you really want to avoid if there's gonna be rain. So choose, um, you know, you can choose not to harvest when it's gonna be raining because you don't want this as it's drying getting wet because again, you can promote, promote things like mold and your grass can start rotting and this is not what you want. So these will just stay here like this. These will just be hung and they're gonna be hung in the, in the air. They're gonna be hung in the sun and these are not too thick so they won't, um, you know, they won't rot. And this is a lot, this is quite a bit of, this is quite a bit of grass. And so you just do this and you can hang quite a bit of bundles wherever you have space. And what you really do in the process is you're helping reduce your feed bell. You're using what's naturally around you and it helps your rabbits stay happy and healthy. And it gives you hay that you don't have to pay for in the wintertime, which in the end, those are all bonuses. Thanks for watching.